Hey guys, I'm back out on the creek today. We've got some lovely sunshine. I've got the little high banker with me. And what I'm going to be focusing on is over here. We've got a bit of bedrock in here. It's a couple of big rocks. I'm going to move those rocks and have a bit of a dig into the bank there. Hopefully we get some good gold results. I'll get into it guys. Start moving a couple of these bigger rocks and get into it. Start to move that big rock. See all this lovely stuff on the bedrock, I'll dig up a bit of that and start working my way in. So I moved that big rock to start with and there wasn't much of a crevice at all. Come over to this left side and the same thing but once I started getting back down here this drops off a few inches so that's got me my first three quarters of a bucket. So it's all this clay gravelly stuff a bit muddier than I was hoping but we'll see what happens. I'll put this through the high banker and we'll move on to the next bucket. Alrighty, I'm about to pan up this first pan, or this first bucket's worth, so it all concentrates down nicely. You can see up that top edge there, just around there. I'll clean it up a bit better. Well, that's good, first pan's on. All right, first pen. That's good for the first bucket, guys. On to the next one. All right, bucket number two. Much of the same sort of material. 
this set of muddy gravelly looking stuff but we'll process this through the high banker so finish processing that second bucket and I don't know whether you'll be able to see it in there but we've got little bits of gold in there some gold in there bit of gold over there as well some up the top so we've got a little bit of stuff visible when it's first turned off that's a positive sign I'll clean it up Grizzly top drain mat in there it's good since making this hopper that top drain mat seems to catch the majority of everything which is what we want Right, we've got this bottom sluice mat in here. So, we'll pan this bucket out. Bit of gold starting to float through. There we go. Some nice looking little bits of gold in there. That's good. Now right, we'll dig a bit more gravel. We'll see what we come home with for the day. Okay, we've got bucket number three. I've just been digging down into here. It's got a little bit of depth to it, not much, but getting up in the edge of this crevice. So we've got another bucket full here and it's the same sort of material. Hopefully we get the same good goal. I'll show you after I process it. That bucket got us nearly nothing. We've got like half a dozen tiny specks in the top there. So, I'm gonna do one more bucket and I'll show you what we get for the day. I'll keep digging. 
So my last bucket just turned into about a third of a bucket. I've just gone and hand dredged and cleaned up the little holes that I've been digging along. So we have a look in here. I was digging back into the bank over there. Under here, a bit hard to see, but there's a hole back down in there. So we've got those two, which I've worked for the first couple of buckets. And then what I did is I moved just upstream just a little bit. And in here, I did another bucket. Just in here. So you can see in there and then a bit down in this little crevice, but this is what got me basically nothing. So that's the little bit of gravel I've chucked into this last bucket. But other than that, I've just hand dredged it. So I'll pan that out now. Okay, so that last tiny little bit of bucket that I snuffed up with me hand dredge basically got us nothing. And we got one, two specks and a tiny little one in that water bottle but what I'll do is I'll give you a show of me gold There's a bit of gold in there. So there's some nice looking gold in there. Some of it you can pick up with your fingers. What I'll do is I'll chuck it on the scales, I don't know if it'll come up as much. But that's a lot for today guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's good to be back out in the bush again with a little bit of sunshine, search for a bit of gold. So if you want to see some more videos, head over to the channel, hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next week. Thank you. Bye-bye.